We're a marine geophysics company based in Burnaby, British Columbia, Canada. Our specialization is uh, deep water robotic systems for geophysical surveys, autonomous underwater systems, unmanned surface vessels, with a specialization in electromagnetics, magnetics, and precision deep water surveying. Our goal is to acquire better data more efficiently for our clients. Better data equals better decisions. And I really think that a lot of the collection of ocean data at the moment is really pretty inefficient. And there's massive gains that are gonna be made through the application of uh, robotics. It's also going to improve accessibility for everybody involved in this field. And whether that means accessibility for people to gain a better understanding and education, or accessibility for people to participate in this economy. So ocean floor geophysics decided to get involved with the ocean supercluster right from the beginning. Uh, we wrote one of the original support letters in support of forming the ocean supercluster. And really our goal in this was to create a stronger link between the east coast, uh, the arctic and the west coast in terms of companies and stakeholders. We find that we were a little bit, funnily enough, isolated. We do more business overseas. So we do more work in Norway, Brazil, Tonga, Fiji, Australia, all over the world. And we don't do any work in Canada. And that's, I think, primarily just from the ocean floor geophysics side is that disconnect between the East Coast, West Coast and the Arctic. So the benefits that ocean floor geophysics have already drawn from membership in the ocean supercluster are definitely the network that is created just through the interaction of the members and also you know, promoted and enabled by the ocean supercluster themselves in making those introductions. And then the second is the economic benefit. So the grant that's allowed us to move forward some technology that we've been thinking about that builds on expertise we have already and really turn that into products and services and deploy that to the world.